uh, SIP app as well, and uh, you know, to kind of keep track of tickets and booking and uh, things like that. First of all, I'd like to thank our sponsors, particularly our principal sponsor, the Arts Council, but all our other partners, and of course, you, the audience, uh, for making this happen. Um, go to Richard Harris by Adrian Sibley. Adrian has uh, the director, he has tackled a lot of, uh, I suppose, figures like Bas Lurman, uh, Kate Bush, uh, Gino De Laurentiis, uh, Anthony Hopkins, and I suppose they, they, these are all pretty kind of complex figures in their own way, but I don't think any of them are as kind of multifaceted as the character you're going to meet this afternoon on the film. And, uh, like for me, I, I think we all have our own version of Richard Harris. I, for me, my first encounter with him, or my first kind of meaningful encounter with, with him was as a teenager in the 80s, uh, reading Hot Press and kind of wondering why the writer Joe Jackson was uh, kind of doing these big features on this ridiculous guy who had this outlandish musical called Camelot. It just kind of seemed really camp and stuff and didn't seem appropriate. Like to me, he was just this guy who was in by his own adventure romps, like the hero of Telemark and the Wild Geeks, and it wasn't until 1990, then with the field there, I kind of discovered Richard Harris, I was kind of comfortable with. But I'm sure uh, people in this audience have their own version. It could be the brooding, uh, brandalist figure uh, from this working life, or it could be the kind of lovable wizard, Dumbledore, uh, maybe even the new musical artist. There's a lot of Richard Harris's out there, and to set the scene on Richard, uh, I'd like to introduce the director, Adrian Sibley. Please give him a big one. Richard Harris had a very unusual life, um, but in essence, it always comes back to Ireland. He was a true Irishman, and the film is trying to reassess who he was um, uh, through the eyes of his sons, <clears throat> which is kind of unusual because his middle son, Jared, has become a very successful actor himself. Um, so it's just thrilling that you guys are all here to see it, and I'm so pleased that um, you're going to see it, and, and hopefully you'll enjoy it. Um, before, um, I, I'm going to take a picture of you. Um, <laughs> I'm just so thrilled to see it. <laughs> yeah, so you all have to wave at me. Wonderful. Hey. <laughs> I will send that to Jared Harris. Very <laughs> Thank you very, very much. Well done. <laughs> Uh, thank you for all that, where we'll be talking later in the Q&A. Thank you very much.